Hey guys, thanks for stopping by. If you like my video, please like and subscribe. Also check me out on Twitch as Floyd Mason. Um, again, I'm probably going to be restarting, you know, the same level over and over. Um, I kind of want to get a smooth run in each level, um, where I just kind of get the, the timing down. Um, I'm not going to time it for the first kind of little bit. I'm just going to let it go. Um, and I will set a save at the start of each level, just so I have a quick, quick go to. So again, the big thing with this game is I want to kind of minimize my jumping as much as I can, especially in these first levels. Um, you know, try and get as few of those as well. Um, so I don't really need them until later. So I mean, pretty smooth. Um, again, I'm gonna kind of run it a couple times. Oops. Jesus Christ. So, so again, it seems like I can get ten. Um, it seems like I can get ten. Basically, they're trying. So can I hit that guy. Um, I'm gonna do some work offline as well, and just like really run over parts. And kind of time them to see if they're quicker oh, doing it one way or another. Um, right? Like, is it quicker basically to jump in this hole, punch him, and get out, or jump over? Um, you know, does it help with the Felix collections if I get those? Um, you know, I should be able to make that jump. Five there. You can jump through that guy, which is a huge help. Um, I don't really want to get that um, one there because I feel like it slows me down grabbing the next thing, so just get the scrub move on. Um, it's probably good enough for the first level. That's for sure. Um, okay. So, this especially comes in handy real quick, um, because again, um, because it just, uh, kind of hits everything around you, so it makes you have to be kind of less careful with your jumps, you know, I could jump on top of a guy, instead of, and like, through him like that, with a little more ease, this part especially, um, I think it's good to have that. that. Um, another thing we have to check is the shortcuts of those um, the bags. Um, basically, they take the little bonus areas, and sometimes they spit you ahead, and sometimes they are just like one way entrance holes. Um, it's not bad. Really. But let's go back. Yeah, I definitely have to jump there. Um, or it does get. Doesn't work too well either. Uh, okay, so jump there, grab that. Yeah, punch me through. Yeah, that's not ideal. Do it right there. Um, I just kind of want to check the level and see if there's any like other shortcut things. I'm gonna check actually the shortcuts oh, up ahead to see where it goes. Just so kind of muck around here. Again, it's so much. You gotta take so much more caution with these guys. Uh, yeah, so let's see if this is one way, if it's shortcut somewhere. Jump. There we go. Yeah, so it's one way, so completely pointless. Getting this kind of, getting that one there kind of sets the time too, so honestly, having eight in the first level is pretty good. Keep that guy all together because it's just a nuisance. 
I mean, not a, not a bad run. Um, sort of practice one more. So I think getting it there is probably the best spot. So let me get a note that I run this. That's oh, okay. um, okay. make a note to come in. Like I could get it there, but doing it here kind of gets that fish to jump, which I think I'd have to like wait and do it anyways. Ah, man. Press the wrong button. Some reason I have two buttons, I both do. Whoops. Oof, boy. Lots of fallen holes. Again, um, I mean, with this, uh, Oops, didn't get my thing. With this running, a lot of it is going to be just dying and kind of, you know, practicing to find the fast techniques. Um, so I'm kind of, you know, slightly altering my timing to see if... Oh man, I don't... Can I... Uh, I just want to practice something here quick. Um, yeah. So I might want to... The problem is I'm trying to jump and then hit that uh, button. And he's got me like three or four times, so I think I need to hit it first and then jump. Yeah, much better. Um, this part's so much easier with it because that guy will get you. Push that. And then there's a pretty good jump right there. You can kind of hit that clean. There we go. I'm pretty happy with that room. Um, we'll start a new one in here. Okay, so we have to jump over. So, I mean, it's probably not bad just to take a little hit there. Um, see if I can time it a little better. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely... Whoop, um, it's definitely a fun game. Like, just to play this game, I, like, I highly recommend it. Um, I mean, like, again, because I'm trying to go quick, I'm avoiding as many power-ups as I can. But they're pretty fun. Get over that guy. Okay. okay. I mean, that worked out pretty well for me, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, okay, gotta go here. Okay, uh, I'm gonna practice once or twice more before taking on the boss. Big thing too, right, is like, this is one of the games where, you know, you can do a big jump or a little jump. Um, actually, I'm gonna take a sec because I wanna write down some notes I have. The big thing uh, for this game is going to be um, kind of timing out when whoop, <clears throat> when to get the the Felix basis. Um, there is actually also a run for this game which you don't get any power-ups at all, um, which is like an interesting one as well. Nice. So you can do like that little jump over. These floors are kind of annoying, so oh, oops, barely made it. So feel yeah, hit that oh, and off timing on that. Um so I kinda wanna plan out my number. So I have 17. 
because it's kind of nice to take damage on that one guy. Um, it's a little, it's just a little faster. So if I can, if I can plan it out to get my third one right after him, which I already got two, so it's not great. Um, like that's such a nice little jump between them. So. So if I can just uh, get <clears throat> right here, perfect. Um, okay, that's probably good enough. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, so what I want to do is hit him six times. Two. Three, four, five, six. I think it hit once by him and finish him. Uh, it's just quicker that way. <clears throat> now, one thing as well is that like, I don't have going on this time, but I want to finish this level basically at a nine. Um, so I'll have to work on my timing. Um, again, like it's good to take damage from that guy. Oops. Um, one. Try one more. Um, yeah, I want to finish with with nine because like it's great to start on that one. Um, so that's pretty good. Um, pretty happy with that. Um, some stuff. Okay, so. So basically I'm just writing down like I want to try to store hit. That tree is in a bad spot to jump. Um, so I don't necessarily want as far as I'm concerned, I kinda wanna just take a hit there. But I need to make sure I can get up to nine. Um, otherwise, which to me either means I need to, you know, if I'm grabbing a tenth one right after him, um, then I A either need to be able to grab nine more easy, which I don't think I can. So I almost need to have the fact where I grab a tenth one right before. Um, and then kind of take like a hit and go back down and still then I'm fighting the boss with that lower one and I get 9. Um, you'll see when we go to the next level why I want 9. Um, and then 9 plus takes 7 hits, so... 6. And you can grab 3 really easily in the boss. But even that one, is, like, I don't want to grab this one. It's not um, an easy, super easy one to do. Right? Like, if you, uh, you know, you don't get it going over, so, like, if you could stop and fall through, um, you could, like, jump up, but those just take, take too much time. Um, but yeah, so, whoop. let's do round 2-1. <clears throat> and you'll see that, you know, this one's super easy to get. You want to kind of get this early, because um, this thing just moves so much smoother. And it kind of goes over the pyramids really easily. So you almost kind of go faster <laughs> um, using them. Like, I'm not even having to press anything. Where with the umbrella, you need to press up, and it's a more awkward angle. So that's, like, super fast. Uh, yeah, I'm working on my, my routing currently. Um, so I'm thinking of doing maybe the first uh, three levels. Um, <clears throat> that was a pretty good run. Um, <clears throat> so this is world two. Like I kind of already did world one. Whoops. Um, and again, whoop, wrong one. Um, so I want to be able to get kind of the thing right here. You know, it's not terrible if you get more, but yeah. So if you can see when you're using the umbrella, he walks up. But, oops. Um, so if I get this one, 
than these two. Now, like, not only am I moving faster, but I literally, without having to press anything, shoot up those. So it's super fast. You know, you come off them at the right speed and right angle to get under that. I can press it once. Um, those ones might be quicker to actually jump up. So it seems like the big ones are good just to like ride, ride out and down. But the little ones may be worthwhile to jump over the next thing, right? Seeing those slows. Try again. Yeah, I mean, like I'm going to do some routing offline um, as well, just like really hammer out what I want to do. But I think it's interesting to kind of see the initial thought plan of what I'm doing. Um, it's obviously right, like right there, getting those two is slow. So I, I want to come to this, this world with nothing. Yeah, that was the... But I'm going to do maybe the first three worlds today, and then I'm going to do a, a run and see if I can improve my PB. It's kind of my kind of my goal for the day. Yeah, I think it's quicker to just jump over those ones. Big ones, you can just ride down. You make it under, that's fine. Little ones, you can just one pump, make it over, perfect. That one got hit, it's fine. I think this one, no, that one I could have ridden down too. Actually, that worked pretty well. <laughs> Oops. I think I have to write that down. That's Best routing for this is little ones, pump once, right there, Ooh, perfect. And you do a little pump to get on here, the big ones you can just run. Good. Pretty happy with the... Uh... Oh, we got one. Yeah. Um, might have to play that one by like here. Uh, I'll try it one more time. Cannon doesn't move, so it's perfect. Um, it's never going to change. I'll be able to avoid the bullet. Yeah, I kind of got to give it like a little second pump, but it's still, I'm sure, faster than going down. <clears throat> because, you can, again, you can control the speed you go up at, you cannot control the speed you fall at. Um, that's good. Oh, just sneak under there. Yeah, so, I mean, that's pretty good. One thing I'll have to go through as well is, again, going through and seeing what the best, you know, like, you can see, right, that, like, he comes down to the base level anyways, like, even if I was at number one, so I'm going to lose my power. That's just what I'm going to write, write down. So good. Yeah, sounds good, Jay. Uh, whoop. Down here. <clears throat> yeah, so do not want to run straight down. Again, a lot of these are going to be like very muscle memory, and when I do go for a record of any type, um, I will be like running. I will be practicing, so let's see how far... I mean, just taking us across this is pretty good. Yeah, I mean, like, that bag's gotta be a shortcut. Um, so, take bag shortcut. Start. Must. Um... But I feel like there'll, there'll be one day 
where maybe I set aside like a couple hours and just, you know, practice a couple times up to it and then have a day where I'm, I'm literally <laughs> just trying to to set my my PB. Oh. Yeah, if you catch the edge of that, it doesn't let you jump. So you almost kinda gotta like do a little jump. Onto this oh, man, no, it didn't let me do it either. Um maybe a long jump to the second one if I can make it. Yeah, that's definitely the best way. Um, get in that as quick as possible. Like, those things too are going to be practice, right? Because it's like, you know, when do I grab it, when do I don't? Like, I'm going to definitely take that shortcut. It's like, i got to have a time to get what I need. So again, best to jump this whole thing. It's easier. Uh, so I have 47. So when I get three, I'm gonna get it. So I kinda wanna kinda do something like that. It's probably the fastest way. And those I can jump, this is nothing down here. And I can get to it that one. So I gotta kinda do that. That double jump. Okay, we got a good uh, route for this one. Run it like once or twice more. So again, kind of like those jumps as small as I can. Um, right now, I happen to know I'm going in needing three. So just grab that best I can, get out. Jump two there if I'm lucky. Here, oh, I kind of want to jump to that brick. Um, we'll save me some time, and if I can double jump that. Everything else is pretty, pretty standard. Okay, uh, we'll do it one more time. Okay. Again, right? Like, I'm not gonna have the what I'm actually running, the ability to know quickly, like what number I'm at. It's not always easy. Like so right now, I'm at 59. Yeah, see, that's what I want to do. Jump on that. Quick jump to second jump. Be all the way up here. Do a quick jump there. Ah, missed that one. Um, I just want to see if I can... Whoop. Just practice this part. So if I go here, whoop. And I jump. Yeah, so know that I can make both of those. Uh, uh, oh. What's the third weapon here? Let's see what that is, too. this one. Uh, one more quick. Okay, yeah. um, I'm gonna quickly see what the third one is and see if it can make that jump. Again, it's like it's nice to have two hits, but you can't. Yeah, you can't get that second. Hit. So even if I had the car there, not super useful. Um, okay, let's just run it once. Um, and again, I really don't think even it would matter how many I have going in here um, because I basically can get everything I need. And if you hold jump to another bag, you do kind of that big jump. But I mean, there's ten in there. Easy. So I can do that jump and that jump. And then down there, good. And do this double jump, and then I set the plane to do that quick single jump. Yeah, that's pretty good. Pretty okay with that that routing. Um, again, I'll have to try and optimize my runs. Uh, um, So, I'm gonna write that down. Want to enter with second power. Um, 
or else that enemy will kill me at start. So let's just run it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um, caught him with this power. I don't have it on. That guy is an instant kill. You, I can't. I either have to pull back or. Ooh. Well, let's just see what's in this bag. We're going. Okay. Yeah. Still run the rest of the level just to see what's going on. Um, Let's see how much time. Yeah, I mean, there's no way taking the the bag is slower than these. So. Yeah, that's a must a must take bag. care about the second power again. Um, this power is probably one of the best in the game, I think. Just because it, it attacks everywhere around you. Ooh. Okay. Um, so this one's not too hard. Again, trying to play as little as I can. I want to kind of double... Ugh. I want to double do it there to get the bat, but also the guy on the ground. Okay. And even though I, you know, I'm kind of like saying this stuff now, like I will definitely forget it <laughs> um, when I do my actual good run. So it'll take practice, right? Like, you know, um, probably watching my own videos, watching some other guys who've already put in like really good routes. Uh, I'll learn, learn to do a block there. the bag. Just a second there. Because again, I might find that it's faster um, at this spot just to like accept the hit. Oh, that might be enough for me. Oof. Just set my save there. I'm gonna assume he also takes uh, seven hits. It was not counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, I'm going to see too quick if my power carries over, um, so if it doesn't, then again, I definitely want to lose it, as it's quicker, you get less points. Uh, and I, I did skip it there, but like, that was a very lucky jump, I feel. I should probably assume I'm going to get that one. Okay, so you do keep... Um, okay, so... Okay. I feel like when I was I was kind of like playing a little, but and I feel like this was a, a pretty fun level run. It's free. You know, you can see like that cloud's like perfectly there. Um, let's see if this uh, bag takes you any good. Okay, so I just kind of want to see like how far back the other bag is. Uh, yeah, I mean like, I feel like that was quicker. Um, 
Um, so I'm gonna just to take that bag. Bag. Again, these are all ones I'll go through and like very carefully time out. Um, but. Kind of for practice sake. Um, I'm just trying to get some like base things that I think, um, and any of the ones that I've written down, like I'm, you know, they're kind of like a test it type thing. Missed it, but. Yeah, took one hit. Nope. Ugh. I mean, that works too. I don't feel like it's as cool as the cloud jump. Uh, Very not used to my safe state too. It's a real low run. That's kind of nice. Uh, actually, yeah, I think I think that was faster. If I went straight low, it's jumping up. I still jump there. Got to remember to check myself. Um, I also want to try something. I feel like in one of the things I watched, they jumped like up and over there. But I mean, it feels just as fast to me to go up and in. One of these times I'll hit the right button next. <laughs> um, I just have it set up so, like, F7 is kind of my active one, but I have one set up for the beginning of each world for the first three. Yeah, that's, that's pretty quick time right there. Um, that. Um, if I hit that well enough, we get up here. It's not too bad. Jump there, you yeah, jump right across there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here it is. Good routing of it right here. I have all the pieces. Yeah, no. Just gotta do them all in one one clean go. So you can have to move on to the next level. Yeah, okay, so here. Oh, no, that's not right. Okay, so don't jump on that, press button, yep, probably do a bigger jump up there, but I'll take that. Ah. Happy with that. It's a good thing that this uh, Felix music is not terrible. <laughs> I feel like the music will get a little quick. Okay. Oh, that's a big thing. I want to hit. Whoop. I want to hit that spring coming out of it perfectly. Because um, I feel if I do, I will get a good bounce. Up. There we go. That part was done better. Yeah, I mean, like, that's definitely it. I gotta, um, gotta block that bird, but it's, it's the right idea. Part's bad, but really want to learn this part, so. Damn. Here, roll down here. 
There we go. That's exactly what I want. I'm not going to run any better than that. Okay. Let's see what World 3 2 is. <laughs> Can I get all the way over? No. So... You expect to jump. Nope. So basically what I'm doing at the start is I'm not holding forward until after I'm kind of going, um, because I have to jump, and I, I hold it right at the start, I kind of get caught in there, it doesn't work. So wait, I'm up here, we go, ah, man, um, I want to try and avoid that first guy, oh, I was holding it, um, ah, man. Yeah, I might have just jumped that entirely. Okay. Wanted to do maybe a big jump there. Yeah, this one's gonna take a bit more work because the uh, jumps are really moving. There's no way in a little like that that bag is not faster, so I'm just gonna assume it is. Ah. Bigger jump there. Okay. Okay. There we go. It's really gonna. Ugh, missed that jump then. Um, really gonna hammer on the uh, hit button on these guys. Oh. Oops. So if Felix hits kind of like the edge of something, like if he's like sliding towards it, he doesn't jump, uh, which is good to know. Yeah, I keep I keep trying to jump over that um, um, jump pad, and it's causing me to just kind of miss. Oh boy, I uh, missed my jump a bit. Oh, oh, I landed on the bird. I didn't know I could do that. Oh, right. Okay. Should get my one uh, there. I'm trying to get it on the other side. Fall down. You hold over, you can get on that perfectly, which is nice. And you need to jump there. Okay, I can dodge those two pretty good now. Ah, man. Just have to find a quicker way across this part. I feel like I'm almost going to take a hit there, so I can run this part. Oh, okay, so you can land on the bird, but you can't jump off the bird. Um, so I'm just going to take a hit there, Expe whoop, expecting that I will get it back in the um, bag part. Oh, did I mess up the jump on the cloud? Okay, alright, here we go. Again, I kind of landed on the bird, which screwed me, because uh, then I couldn't jump off, and my jump was off. Okay. But yeah, taking, the, taking that one hit there seems much faster. I wanted to time it out to see if that cloud was there, and it's not. But... 
That one is, that's fine. Maybe if I delay a second there, it'll be there, because I think that'd be quicker than jumping it. Yeah, I mean, that's so much quicker, just taking that hit. And then I can, whoop, press the life. Um, taking that hit is so much faster. Puts all this stuff in order, lets me sneak by that. Working so much on the start, I'm not uh, familiar with the next part. So, wow, fall apart in the start. Felix definitely takes a second to be able to jump. It's not like, um... Man. It's not like Mario where you kind of like hit the ground and can kind of keep moving, like, he takes a second. jump there. Um, I think this is going to be the last world I do for now, um, and then try running, because I'd like to try and run it at least once or twice, knowing that I'll make mistakes in it. Um, just kind of want to like, get started doing this part, uh, practicing, and again, a lot of it will be done. Oh man, if I could jump off that bird. I need to get through this level. Cool. It's the. Uh, Give me some time. Um. Oh. Yeah, I'm all thrown off there, but I have that part okay. I'm not too worried about it. Ah! The bird was just in a bad spot. Ah. Um. Yeah, like, you know, a lot of these parts I will put in practice offline. Because um, again, it's a lot of over and over, and, you know, um, I will single out specific spots like this one where I feel there's good time saving, um, but it's going to just take me more practice than I really want to sit and just do the same jump over and over and over 30 times in a, in a stream. But I need five. See, that's the most perfect so you can get that. Okay, let me get that good jump. That's as good as it'll get. Nice. Yeah. I mean, the ending's pretty good. Like, once you get in that bag, um, the ending's not bad. It's just that front front part has some moves to it. You, you feel the grind? I mean, that's good. I'm glad to hear it. Um, take a quick break with some coffee. So, I got a couple notes on over in this one. Wait, which world is this one now? So, L2, take bag.
Yeah, I mean, like, you know, if they're good, I'll, uh, maybe keep some fine ones on. Um, but, yeah, let's get started. So this one I get to start, I guess, at the level I'm at, which is interesting. Just kind of checking out like what's lower, and then I'll replay and do high. Okay. Yeah, let's see what's high. I think these ones will be the hardest ones. In my in all honesty. I'll always end it with a run, because um, again, like I'd like to to use what I've learned, to kind of try and um, get that my PB. Um, I don't want to do too many, because I might want to do two runs, and again, they take about half my reach. So, okay, I'm going to go high. I'm going to go higher at first, to get over the first uh, big obstacle. Then I'm going to go real high to start. Um, and then drop low for a bit. That worked pretty well. I'm only gonna go low. Yeah, so I think I want to go high and then drop down the first one, and then go low for a little while. Because again, right, like in theory, I should run these parts slightly better than my original times. But will I run the rest of it better? Who's to say? Yeah, because I want to kind of be high coming up, up to that part, and then immediately when I'm through it, go low. Maybe raise. After that one falls, drop. Yeah, no. Gonna wait after it. So when I see that one stream both ways. Okay. It's not that one. Ooh. Like so I wanna try to drop like here. Right after those guys. If I can cut it. Maybe like after this guy, if I can like drop it in here, I can maybe sneak through there. We'll try that. I mean, I like, it's there, but I keep getting hit by that uh, the cannon. Let's see if I can dodge it this time. If I can't, then I gotta go down earlier. So those ones are easy enough to avoid. That's easy. Okay, maybe I can... I think after the second one, if I drop long enough that he shoots over me, then scrip up, and then get back down again. Oops. Um, should be okay. After he shoots, strip down, strip up, strip down. I mean, that was closer. I feel like this strip down would be easier. Again, too, yeah, like, I'm gonna have to, like, watch my own stuff and make, like, really good notes. Um, and the time I go for, like, my real, real personal best, best I'll ever do, will need to be, like, watching it frequently. I kind of want to drop, I feel like the perfect place to drop is like right here, 
and then getting lucky with the timing on things. So I need to get it right once to see if the timing works. If it does, it's going to be the best drop I think I can get. Yeah, if I, hadn't, if I hadn't pressed the up button, I got scared. Um, but I think I have enough room to drop in there. Great. There. Oosh. Ah, damn. I think I got me, but... I'm pretty happy with that part. That's, uh... Again, I'm kind of gauging on the fact that I'm not at, oh, uh, I'm not at any point really not holding right. So I'm not stopping. Not losing my momentum. Which is why I think that's the best one. But I get low. I want to get near his bullet there, make it to him. And then keep as low of these guys as I can. Yeah, it's too high there. Too high there. <clears throat> up on those guys, come a little more down to earth for him. Uh, hit too high but not bad. Hit him. Ah. Missed him. Yeah, because I think, I don't think um, I can get through that spot there without taking a hit. So I want to have my balloon until then. That's a great drop. Perfect. Hit him. Hit him. What's that? Don't know why I didn't take damage there. There's still a lot of level to go. I'm gonna go low, it's not too bad. Let's see what the rest of the level looks like. Another real skinny one to get through. Wow, it's a really long level. Um, I don't think I'm going to worry too much more about this one right now. Um, I feel like one levels like this, I feel, are going to take me the longest. Um, they're going to take a lot of just practice on them to really get, like, exactly when to hit the buttons. It's like, look at that. Like, that's a perfect drop. There we go. There's the hit I knew I'd take. Oh, oh there's a bag here. Ooh, this goes. Oh, that's empty. So, don't want the bag. Um, and then, you can mostly go low for the rest of the run. Again, I might have to play with it to kind of see if there's faster ways up above, but going low protects you from a lot of the cannons. And there's spots like this, but I mean, I don't necessarily think that'd be easier coming down either. Yeah, so let's uh, go check out the boss here. Honestly, I, I think he's almost easier with the, my lesser power-up. So you're just such a big, uh, a big target otherwise.
Yeah, I mean, uh, you know. It is what he is. Um, so I think now what I'm going to do is a straight run and see how it goes. So, reset the game. Um, again, like I'm feeling a little more comfortable with the first levels. Um, I don't expect to hit half of the, the stuff I did. <laughs> um, I thank you for the height. Um, so I will get open my next cut split. And pull it up. Go. Um, <clears throat> so this is my current current personal best um, across the world. Which, you know, is I'm, I'm pretty happy with it, but I'm hoping to beat it. Um, I likely will restart if I don't get a good first world. Um, you know, I'd say if I go over three minutes. Well, maybe not over three. If I'm, like, just over three, I'll probably leave it. Um, but I don't want to lose too much time on it. If it's the big one I feel I can do a little better in. Um, I just gotta remember how exactly it works for sure. Um, okay, so it's going, and then if I go... Got my buttons going. Get ready. And, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. I feel like I've already forgotten so much of what I learned, but uh, that's okay. It's more too. Oh. Yeah, I'm definitely. Uh, <laughs> Restarting on that one. Um, can't be dying like that right off the start. Um, a lot of it will be watching my own stream. Again, you know, very new to the uh, speedrunning. Um, so, but I want to get a good start. <laughs> can't be dying in... World uh, one one. There, that guy, this guy. Bad spring. Ah. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna restart on that one. Um. Those guys are just not worth it, ever. They uh, take two hits, even with like your second power-up, so... I can't have a, I can't have a death in Rogue One. It just uh, will not get me anywhere. Sure. Man, just that spring again. Last time there, like, I have to remember to jump for that, but I'll live with that. You know, cost me, like, half a second. And you gotta jump there. See, I really need my magic by this point. Ugh. Whoa! Um, what happened there? My game kind of actually closed out for a second. I'm going to again reset. Ah, uh, boy. What's going on? Um, let me close some things. So just like, it's kind of stuttering a bit right now. I don't know. Uh, That it. What else do I need? Get all 
this. Uh, I don't know if it's like now because of the time we're going with the stuff I'd open, but. Uh, I kind of stuttered that I walked right into a death. Can't have those. I'm gonna make all my own mistakes. I don't need tactical ones to slow me down as well. Oh. Yeah, I mean, not, not the best jump, but uh, clean enough. There we go, we got him jumped. There we go. I probably should have grabbed that one at the end because I want to get this magic power right away. But again, I think 8 is what I said. And then you get the one ramp to start here, and then this one. Yeah, perfect. That, get that guy off? Yeah, that's exactly what I was doing before. And then. Yep. Yep. We go. It's pretty good. Level one, two. Kill that guy right at the start. So that's a good start to this level. I think I still gotta work out because I wanna be able to take a hit there, but. Oh. <clears throat> That's not great. Um, I wanna be able to take a hit on that guy. And I should have probably left it. Two, three, four, five, six. Like now you see, I only have 33, so it's really gonna slow me up. Oh, right. Okay, so um, it's really gonna slow me down at the start of World Two. Because I'm going to start with Paracel, and it's gonna take me. I can't do my little kind of cheats up here. It's much slower. Bummer. It's a really easy level to get a good time in. Because I've used the parasail, it's a lot harder. There we At least I had like a really good time in the first level, makes up for a little, but I really gotta work on World 1 3. And again, like it kinda sucks that I don't have my power here, but I will get it back. Oh no! What are the odds of that? That's just bad timing. No way I could have uh, <laughs> predicted that counter. So I'm only two in here. Go. Oh, I missed that jump, but it's okay. Get that one. Ugh. Gotta jump smaller there. I'll survive it. Okay, I mean, lost some time with the death, but. I think it's because I didn't start running right away, <clears throat> um, so I gotta know to keep going. Good, <laughs> 
good. Take. Again, like, that's not ideal, but I luckily had enough <clears throat> stuff there. I could afford to do it. And, uh, this guy, I'm just going to keep my power. Um, so I feel like I want it in this one. <clears throat> if I recall my notes. jump off that. So you just like not jump off the springs. Good. Oh, one jump straight from there. A little lost time, not bad. Overall pretty pretty clean level. <clears throat> this level ugh. Not. Oh. oh boy, that was a uh, very poorly executed, and I just lost uh, my next power up. That's a bummer. level is pretty easy. <clears throat> okay, um, definitely not, not a clean one, but a good spot to know, like, that's a practice level. That's one that, uh, needs work. Okay, this one, now, I'm, uh, you know, kind of flying by the seat, but I feel like I have a good enough strategy to get me through the first half. Oh no, Ooh. not anymore. Yeah, I knew he was going to get me. It's an ugly one. <clears throat> yeah, losing losing the balloon power. Man. Losing the balloon power, especially like um, getting hit, you know, like it just kind of restarts you wherever. <laughs> so it's kind of hard to know what to do. Like, I really gotta get better at just not dying, no matter what. You know, I think it's better in these ones. If I get hit, just go full safety strats and just avoid them. I think it's a lot less time consuming in the end. Yeah. Cause again, too, like, I mean, it's easy enough to die in this game. It's not the hardest game, but when you're trying to go quick, you're gonna take some hits. As a whole, I shaved some time off in those three worlds, but definitely not. <laughs> yeah, and that was a worse world for you. Okay, so again, I kind of want to play cautiously and just make sure I get this. I 
Oh, pretty good. That level's not too tough, I don't think. On to a continue though. Oh, no. Boat level. Yeah. First continue. Not ideal. See if this uh, takes me somewhere good. Hopefully, oh no, it's empty one. Come on, don't land on something weird. Come on. Ugh. Now I'm just getting unlucky all over the board on this level. Comes with trying to go too fast when you're doing the levels memorized. It's so easy to take damage. Oh. So I will say, I think that this one and probably the uh, ice one are by far the hardest to go oh, make that jump. Again, I just want to be careful at this point and not lose any more lives. I can't have a best time if I uh, don't beat the game. Oh, my god. Water level then. There we go. Yikes. Yikes. Whew. I already have, without even doing this this level, a worse time than that. Than before. This is not ideal. Basically giving away all of my time I've gained in the first two levels. Um, but like I said, I'm probably going to do two runs. So... Ugh. Oh, come on. I feel like I'm getting a lot of just bad, like, things just kind of clipping me. Killing me. Um, <clears throat> so hopefully, you know, I can pull this one out to make up some time in the other levels. Um, and the next run goes a little smoother. Just need to get one here. Okay. As a whole, I'm still still slightly ahead, but uh, not as much as I'd like to be. It's too many points. So I kind of want to get up to the cannon in this one to take out those dinosaurs. Um, yikes! Um, take out those dinosaurs so I can take them on one hit. Just parts like this where they're unavoidable. Um, I played it slightly, um, because like I set those, um, save points, but it was more kind of like, oh, um, so I played it through just to get to those save points and, and kind of made sure that I had the right total, um, and then I played it like just once, kind of played it through again, just to, you know, go through the levels, I wasn't trying to rush, um, didn't time myself or anything like that. So not, not overly. Um, 
you know, it might be the kind of thing, again, and it's why I'm saying, like, I might do some stuff off streams, is I feel like I just need to pick this up for, like, a half hour every two days, and, you know, um, go to one of the safe spots, go to and just play through. Just keep it, like, fresher in my mind of what's going on. Um, start getting the, the levels have a little bit more muscle memory than I have with them right now. is right now, I'm playing too much, like I'm dying way too much. Um, so I need to, A, know the levels better to stop, um, but also just like, get better at being cautious when I need to be cautious. Oof, didn't know if I was going to make that. Uh, make four more. So that's just like a dead stop, because I was stuck. Taking some hits to get back down, like why not? Oh boy. Take that back, because this guy is a nuisance. Oh no! Um, I think this is the toughest boss of the game in my opinion. Uh oh. Yeah, I was like, why did I jump like that? But again, what an odd spot to start, because I just don't know where I am. I have no conjecture of like where I can jump. Um, <clears throat> ah, this is, yeah, this is not going to be a good run. Um, you know what? I think I'm just going to scrap this run. Um, it's not going well, and I'm definitely not going to be my time. Um, so I'm just going to restart it. Um, you know. Things learned in that one is again, I have to play more cautiously when I'm when I'm one hit in these later levels, um, especially the water ones. Um, that boss, especially, I think I need the most practice on. Um, he's similar to the second boss, except the second boss is so much easier to control his movement. You push him back, so he never really gets at you. But that guy, if you have to punch him straight on, he sometimes, you know, he runs across the screen. So it's much easier to kind of have your other power and jump over him and still get the hit. Um, but you know, still a still a very big kind of learning learning um, experience for me. Um, and I remember speed ran anything, um, and a big big part of his memorization, which will take time. But yeah, let's get going again. Because again, if you know where every enemy is, um, whoops, you know, you know every jump you're supposed to make. Like again, like that jump right there, I'm not supposed to make, and it just cost me a couple seconds. Up like, oh, I probably should try to make that full jump. Um, and perfect, I have eight going in here, which is what I want. Because <clears throat> um, again, not only am I trying to avoid them, but I'm trying to think in my head that I want eight. Because I, I want to get this right here. Oh no, it's actually not where I want to get. I want to get the second one. And I messed it up. Think too much about it. Um, so now I gotta again play a little cautiously. Like, parts like this are going to slow me down, so I'm just off my timing. <clears throat> more, just get that. There we go. So hopefully that didn't cost me too much... Oh boy. Yeah, I'm, I'm restarting again. 
Um, awful start. Awful, awful. Um, This is this is the one. This is uh <laughs> stop stop screwing around, stop messing it up. The good the good run of the day. But again, I have so much respect for um, you know, speedrunners. Because it's it's not it's not easy at all. Like they make it look easy, it's insanely difficult. But what's insane about it is their consistency. Um you know, the fact that you can go on something like games them quick, and, like, they don't make mistakes, really. Like, they'll be like, ooh, I missed this one thing, and that cost me, you know, one second. Oh, I'm, I'm again restarting. I was talking too much and just distracting myself. Um, yeah. Just try your best. Thank you, Andrew. Um, it, it's one of those, it's one of those, like, weird things, because, you know, again, you want to go as fast as you can. But... You also have to realize at the same time that, like, <clears throat> until you're better at the game, you can't. Like, I need to, in my brain, slow down and be like, slow down, think about what's coming up next, think about the jump you have to do, and if I'm getting hit, like, slow down. Um, because a, a lost life will set me back way more than, you know, than just slowing down and making sure that the enemy doesn't hit me. Um, okay. Oh, I don't think I even showed it. I got my, uh, got my Felix shirt on. Good luck. Not super helping right now, but, you know, it's pretty cool, pretty cool little cat. Uh, okay, here we... Do that one again, but I didn't die, so I'll keep, keep it going. That's the one I want to get. <clears throat> that puts me on my rhythm that I need to be on. These guys are so much easier. Just, uh, I'm, not, I'm not gonna add to it twice in a row in the first level. Um, basically, again, that, that's what I was talking about was I hit jump, but because he doesn't quite have enough room, um, Felix will just run off. He does not like to jump that little last piece, so, so you kind of gotta watch your jumps. Um, I swear I will stop resetting soon, but I refuse to die twice in the first one. Um, dying is about the worst because, again, it's just like where it resets you, it's it's completely based on where you died. So unless I died in every single spot possible, had every possible starting spot memorized, it's very difficult to kind of come out of a, a death quickly. There we go. That's about as flawless of level 1-1 one, one I can do. So that's a good start. Um, I think if I make it through all of World 1 again without dying, um, then it'll be the run no matter what happens. Because again, I can't just keep... You know, the point of this is not to be perfect. Um, I have to accept that I'm going to make mistakes on later levels, and I just want to get a new run in um, with some hopefully new new PBs on 
at least a level basis. Much better. Much, much better. Um, miss hit one thing there, um, but luckily it didn't cost me, was I hit my power too early and missed an enemy. But, uh, happened to not hit me, so we'll take it. So now again, I want to get up to 9 here, so that I'm ready for the next level. That guy's just kind of whatever to me. I don't have a good way of dodging yet, so we won't need that jump. And I should be able to get 3 in here easy. Whoop. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. <clears throat> so that's about as perfect as it's going to get. Ending with 9, very low score. Yeah, so this would be the run. This is a great World 1, and where I'd like my my PB on that world to sit. Probably should grab that one, but I feel like it's easier to get this one. Unfortunately, I had to take a little bit of time there. Just because that bird was gonna get me, but whipping up these will be super fast, so I'll make that time back up. Not, uh, not perfect, for sure. Um, twice I had to kind of pull back because my timing wasn't exactly where I wanted it to be and I would have got hit, but still pretty good. Oh, I'm worried now that we're going to get that weird jump down here again. So yeah, I'm just going to wait for that bear face to go by. <clears throat> so again, like lost the... Uh, Lost about a second because I was being whoop, whoop, missed that jump. Um, being cautious, but there we go. the rest of it was very clean. Um, so maybe lost like two, three seconds there overall. <clears throat> Not terrible. That guy good. Okay, so he's got that. This jump was a bit much. Nice, nice, good. I think the rest of this level is pretty easy, other than one base you gotta be careful of it. Oh, dang it. I waited for him to shoot because I knew it was gonna be a pain. Um, and then he still. Still did me dirty. But, get this back. You know, again, a couple seconds lost because I was waiting for him to shoot instead of just taking the hit and moving on. But, um, still an okay fight against him. I would have liked to have keep, kept my power <clears throat> um, as you do get to carry into the next world, but. What are you gonna do? I'd rather just finish him off. Um, Move on. So. Okay, let's be a little more cautious because I don't have my regular stuff, but I'll get it in here. So there we go. That problem is avoided. Yeah, shaky level, but, you know, no deaths, we'll take it. Um, my timing was bad there, so... I 
go up because I lose my power. Which, you know, it's one of those things that, like, it helps you in that second, but, like, you might be able to save more time by using your power. But anyways... So it's tough to say, like, right now, like, is that the best? Come on, game. That's cheap. That is cheap right there. Um, basically, holding left always hits that. Hits that, so I don't know why it uh, missed that time. So it's a set coming out of a thing timing, so. It's unfortunate. Only first life lost, though. Not too much time. <clears throat> still, still below on this level, which is good, because last time I was not. And we got this. This is a level that cost me big. In the last run. Oh, God, I hit it again. Okay, so now what I want to do is get my power back. See, this world, like, it's it's just too easy to get hit from anywhere. Um, so, I think it's worth it just to get this back, because not only does it then give me one hit later, but... Oh, I can't like that. Oh my god. This level is... Probably practice some of the most, too. It's just kicking my ass. Um... Don't want to go into the boss necessarily without a hit either. So let's try and get five save back up. Ooh. Two more. There we go. Perfect time. So again, you know, giving up some time on that level, but again, honestly, if you if you die, it probably costs you more time in the long run. So, <clears throat> just suck it up, take it that that level what might not be your best one. And take it for the sake of the run. Okay. Yeah, see that one's just going over my best. Now, what's unfortunate with the water levels as well, and I believe I checked it, and I think the dolphin's like the best one you can get, so like you only can ever have two hits, which is so unfortunate. It's just the easiest one to, to take damage in. Again, it, it, uh, even though I, oof, oof, even though I had, ah, God, I hate this level, um, even though I had the second power-up, it still started me at the base one, which is kind of, kind of trash, you know? Like, I don't fully understand why sometimes powers carry over and sometimes they don't. level, I would love, like, a third hit. Uh, it'd be this one. I think I gotta watch some other people's playthroughs of, of this of this world and see how they deal. Um, oh, don't lose this. Thank you. And again, just like, being a little, whoop, whoop. Being a little more cautious this time. Just to uh, not die. Okay. 
But yeah, I think actually going under them like that and doing that little jump is probably the fastest way. I think it goes there for a sec, but I don't think it really cost me any time. <clears throat> okay. I mean, not bad. Not too bad. Quickly get back up with power here, so got my turtle bud. Um, so I feel pretty good about, like, again, you know, to get better kind of feeling on the timing of the crabs and all that, but. Fairly easy to avoid, but it was not super long. Turtle's pretty solid. Oh, oh. Ah. Perfect though. So, that right back. Oof. I was pretty sure you only have one hit left, so I went for it. Um, let's start me, you know, would have liked to have more than two going into next round, but not like a three. But, I mean, a better record in that level, so... So again, I kind of want to get the cannon in this level from what I've seen. Uh, oh. um, some parts like this where he's just unavoidable. Um, <clears throat> I think he takes three hits with this power-up. So, having the cannon takes him on one. Um, much, much better. Um, so this world, I feel like I didn't have too much trouble with it last time. Um, just gonna stay low, not too much happens. Make sure I'm getting enough helix parts to, uh, not lose the power-up. Kind of is... I think all you have to do with this one. It's kind of lean too. Uh, oh, okay. Um, it's kind of lean with this level is you can get hit in your balloon and be hurt, but your balloon is not good enough to collect the, the Felix heads, which is super lame, super unfair. Still have four, three, come on, end. And again, the milk, um, <clears throat> up in the top left, you have your hearts, and as soon as those run out, you lose the power up. But if you use milk, that never fills it. So, just to be safe, I got it to make sure I made it through. You know, it costs you a second, but again, it's just kind of like I need to get better at using kind of those safety strats. Or some uh, very near falls I just took. First hit gets me. 
man. I really, really hate this guy. He's like literally, legitimately the only hard boss, I think, in the game. The only one I have trouble with. Um, and it's just because like, he shoots and runs, and you can't, I can't really tell anything. God! Stop, dude. I mean, this is easier. It's just like jump it and stand beside you. I'll get two hits in. Okay. I mean, again, certainly not not my greatest. It's pulling my time back up to what it was, but. Did exactly what I wanted was get to 79 and then try to avoid the rest until I got hit. Um, like to me right now, this level of practice is just trying to avoid dying. Oh, shit. So it's a very tricky level. Um, ah. Kinda of hard to describe, but like, oof, no, dang. But um, controls are just a little tricky, and like, those guys on the ground are very hard to predict um, until you kind of, I'm assuming, played it, memorized when they shoot, where they shoot. Um, luckily, it's it's a lot longer or shorter than the other water level, um, so it's got that going on for it at least. But. Turtle buddy, please. One more. Ah. Good, and a one up. It's having the range and the the feeling that you can at least take a hit. Uh, just makes it so much easier to play. Ooh. Okay, made some time back up in that level, so I'll be happy with that. <clears throat> Again, I think it's just being cautious in that water level, only losing one life was a big time saver. This level is pain too. <laughs> uh, this is one of those ones that again will take some like memorization of uh, those snowballs. 
They are... They come to the screen very quick. So you don't always have time to react. But, I mean, with this power-up, it's definitely doable. If you were to die or, or come in without it, uh, it'd be a much harder level. to lose it, which is not great. Dang. Perfect time. I was trying to get enough to get um, another thing of milk, but that works too. Come on, be done. All the yes. Okay. I mean, I feel like I ran way better than I did the first time I played this game. <clears throat> I feel like I got stuck in this level for a while. I still need seven to get an upgrade again. Whoop! Oh, bad jump. Um, with bats on the roof, you definitely want your power up because um, it protects you from things above you. So let's make sure we're getting it. Two more. There. And now I can just spam it to protect me when I jump up. Also, I think I'm just going to keep this power up for next world. <clears throat> At this point, I just want it. Um, you know, want to be safe. I saved a lot of time in that world. <clears throat> um, so this world is just a shooter, so there's really not um, much time you can save. It's just trying to avoid dying like that. God. First guy, come on, man. Um, but, yeah, you can't... <clears throat> Basically, I looked up and there's like... There is a perfect time for this world where it's like... When you're at this amount of seconds, move to the right, and you'll get to the end the quickest. Other than that, um, you know, you don't have any control over the speed, so there's nothing you can do. Oh my god. And a kid. Oh, boy. <clears throat> um, when, I was, when I was thinking about this, I was like, oh, I probably don't need to practice this level as much. It's just a side-scroller. Um, you know, like, set one. But, uh, yeah, maybe I do. <laughs> I'm not doing great at it today. <clears throat> I think every other time I've played it, like, I've literally only died. At the end, there's, like, a four attack that comes. Oh! Um, and I, I tend to die there or right after it. Um, which is right at the end. But, uh, today, I'm just dying all over the place. There we go. Get health back up. Again, just the big thing is, like, I need to keep my spaceship powered. So you gotta make sure you're collecting... Oh, oh, oh. Collecting these Felix masks, which... Dang! Oh, I'm blown away all the time I made up in the last level by just really shoddy play here. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble today. I think before I stuck near the bottom, and I'm trying to get near the top today. Oof. Um, maybe that's it. <clears throat> it is easier to dodge going up, because you have control over up, you do not have to... Ooh. Control over going down. So 
basically I see the four attack series. That means I'm almost done. Basically, any second it's just gonna like, go right and uh, finish. Yeah, that should be enough to keep me in the end. Yeah, there we go. <clears throat> it's definitely not my greatest on that one. <laughs> I think with this level, it's just, uh, my time's do pretty good, um, I think it's just about being cautious about that. Um, this one's gonna take some definite practice, um, you know, knowing where all these balls fall, like, knowing when to run, knowing when, you know, like, that part, like, it looked like I could make it under, but... You know, also knowing like which one of those holes uh, guys jump out of. Um, so I know, you know, if I need to slow and just give it a second or if I can risk it. Yeah. It is a short level though. I also don't know if, like, maybe if you get the cannon, you can take those out or something. Um, you know, they might be very similar to um, the dinosaur world, where... Ooh, I ducked out. That was a good duck. Oh, no! He didn't jump. That's on, that's on Felix, that one. I pressed jump. Oh. What a, what a crap place to start. Um... I pressed jump, and Felix just said, no thanks. Again, just kind of want to be cautious. Get my second hit back. You know. Don't need a PB on, on this world. Didn't practice it. Uh, I'm cur um, I practiced the first three levels, and now I'm doing a... Full run, and I'm in world 9-2, which is the second last level. 9-3. Um, so, I'm currently about uh, 5 minutes ahead of my personal best. So it'll be close. I feel like I'm going to shave maybe, hopefully, uh, a little bit of time off. But, oh, getting hit on the first guy. Um, this level is, is tricky. Um, and then, again, you got to beat the, the final boss. So... Um, again, I'm just trying to play it cautiously at this point, so I want my second hit. There we go. Because I have not practiced these levels at all. So, four more. Three. Two. Um. Okay, so... Basically, from the ones I saw, were take the time, get these level ups, um, and give it to him with the can. Plus hits. It's, um, time going in there is, is not lost. <laughs> but I do it, and then worst case scenario, it hits you, and you can just still just finish him off. Time. <clears throat> Whew. Um, yeah, so, that's it. I shaved, what, three, three minutes? Three and a half minutes off? My best, Jay, you caught the very, very end of it. 
Um, yeah, because all this is... The one I saw, you get to stop the time right on the last boss hit, because this is all... Oh, ah, thank you, Lander. Um, yeah, so I mean, you know, in theory, I, I need to figure it out too, so I can show... Again, <clears throat> right now my timer shows my totals, but I want to see it by like level by level too. Um, figure out how much better I did on each one. Yeah, really good timing. Um, yeah, the ninth world is actually pretty short in comparison to other ones. Like, it's very easy to die, but very short. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I mean, that's, you know, again, a little bit of practice. Um, I really had a good world set. You can see I, I <clears throat> was only 43 seconds of my best there, and I came out three minutes ahead. So when I played the first time, I must have been... Um, I must have had a really bad World 7, um, because it's clearly beatable, and World 9 even, like, I knocked I knocked off my time there, because I had a much better boss fight. That boss fight is so much easier. 25th? That's pretty good. I'll take that. Um, I think, again, like, I think once I get below 30 minutes, uh, let me check the... Boards here. <clears throat> yeah, so putting me, um, if I was to run in about 20, 29 minutes, if I could knock off two more minutes, um, then I'd be top in the top 20, um, which I think is is very reasonable spot to be. Oh, there's actually someone in, in there that only ran, uh, who just got verified a week ago in the top 20. <clears throat> there's also one from 13 years ago. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm, you know, I'm happy with that run. Um, definitely things to improve on. You know, again, you can see there's, the way I understand that it works is <clears throat> the green ones means that I as a whole, was doing better than my personal best as a whole. Um, yeah, you and Buster, um, you know, he's running the game too. Um, and and the, the top record in this game was only set three months ago. Um, so it's pretty recently someone's been playing it. <clears throat> um, but uh, yeah, I think in all of, I beat all of my personal best except World 3, 5, and 8. And 8 definitely should be a lot easier. Um, that should be one that I never die in. That I have a very consistent good time. So that one's unfortunate. Uh, not being what I might be. Actually, can I? So let's save those splits. Um, trying to figure out how. Again, some way you can do it like where it's just the actual level levels and not the total. Um, if I can figure out how to do that right now. Um, this time. So, I don't know. I, I have to figure out how to get it. Like, again, I, I'd like it to show my overall um, and my save time, but also kind of like my time per level. Um, because, again, saving three seconds on a level is great, but if I'm already doing it in, you know, three minutes, there's not a lot of time to save there. But if I'm doing one in seven, you know, maybe there's, there's time. In there. Um, but it's pretty good. Um, I'm going to, again, as I said, I think I'm going to try and continue playing 
a little bit offline just to keep myself fresh um, instead of waiting two weeks. <clears throat> um, and then again, kind of do this every week or two weeks, stream some of my progress uh, so you can kind of watch, always end with at least one run. And I'll probably do what I did like this time is kind of try and get a really good world one. Like basically, I don't think I'm going to get much better on world one. I mean, I knocked almost 30 seconds off, um, but I felt it was pretty smooth. Thanks for watching. Please click to check out my other videos, like and subscribe, and come by Twitch under Floyd Mason to join my live streams.